Welcome to lesson three, task six, and this is the final task of the game. We now want to finish our countdown timer. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to go into the events palette and drag out a when green flag is clicked. Again, this is going to run in parallel to this script. We need then to go into the control menu and drag out a forever loop. Remember the forever loop are called C blocks or control blocks. They're made up of C's. They're also called wrap blocks in Scratch. These blocks loop the blocks within the C and check if a condition is true. So what's going to happen is we're going to then drag out a wait one second. So when the green flag is clicked, the game is going to wait one second, then it's going to change the timer by minus one. We're going to change the timer and because it's a countdown timer, we're going to select minus one. This condition will keep going and going and going until the timer equals zero. When the timer equals zero, it will stop the game. Remember to save your work. And that is the final tutorial on this game.